welcome to my room. Uh, I'm gonna try to keep this as simple as possible, sort of, so this doesn't go on for an hour. Okay, so this is behind my door. I have my Neville sweater. My mirror it used to be white, I painted it black. Shoes, makeup area, my bags, and just some little decorations. And then my skeletons are up here, and if we move this way, here's my other mirror. My little sitting area. This is my green wall, aside from the two beside my door. Got, you know, some maps, some plants. I made this myself with some bones and some crystals. Moving over this way, we have my bed area full of my, some of my Squishmallows and Buddy, who is very important to me, and also Rilakkuma. And then this wall is quickly becoming my favorite wall. It's been my favorite wall for a long time, really, I guess. Um, I've got a bunch of maps and different postcards and my shelf my dad helped me build and some more collage on the wall and my dad built this headboard for me and it holds Anubis, a globe, some books, my National Geographic magazines and then over this way my window is very bright, give me just a second. I have my cute little flags, shark poster, demon slayer poster, my little crate nightstand, and then this is my desk area over here. So we have yoga mat, skateboard, demon slayer collection, extra paper, and then this is my tea station. I have to move around my bed to get over here. I have my pin collection, some autographs, some more of my squishmallows, and this is my little tea station in my room. It's one thing I'm proud of, and I don't know if this video will go up first or the other one will go up first, but I do have a process on DIYing this whole area that will come out sometime either before or after this video <laughs> so this is just an electric tea kettle and I make my tea here in the mornings and then my other shelves this is where I keep my extra tea stuff and then right over this way is my desk area this is an old monitor that used to be at my grandparents house that I just brought here since it wasn't getting used it's nice to have the extra space to multitask I've got my keyboard and stuff, and then some more collage on this wall. This is where I keep my cameras. The one I'm holding right now usually goes right there. Some notebooks, my tarot cards, some more books, and then a really cool painting my aunt gave me. And one of my newest, most prized possessions is this hoodie makeshift plush. I'm really sad I missed Masky, but you know what? It's okay. <laughs> Coming over this way, um, yes, that is broken. Don't say anything or you're homophobic. Joking. This way is my t TV slash game area. And this shelf just holds like incense and some extra traveler's notebook stuff. My washi tape printer and my Cricut. Then I've got some plants. And then this is where I keep my PS4 games. Got, you know, my little Nathan Drake shrine. And behind my TV is just some more posters. So I keep the Wii and the Wii games. And then I have, excuse the wire from my controller. I was charging it. You know what, it's a little chaotic, but it's okay. It's just how it is usually. <laughs> so I have some more manga here, Titalia and Angels of Death. And I've got some little plushies. And then I got books and more plushies and more cameras and more art supplies um this is my zelda shelf and then i've got my elephant holding up my snake plant and the switch 
And then that's my dog's bed. And over this way is just my closet. I didn't like the door, so I just hung some curtains on it. I'm thinking about replacing the curtains with tapestries sometime soon. And then very up top is my Harry Potter shelf. And then that is pretty much all of my room, except for my suitcase I forgot to show you. It's got a bunch of old sketchbooks and stuff in it. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed and see you in the next video, I guess. Bye.